Hello, this is Jack Goodwin here. I just want to do a video about immersion. Immersion is very important, especially when you are learning. Immersion gets you better in character. It is definitely good to have a proper attire and it's in good for you to, you know, speak in a vocabulary that is you know, somewhat not immersion break. Immersion you can probably define as you are fully engrossed, fully into the environment that you are in, that you are pretending to be something else, or you're watching the show, totally lacking self-awareness. So you're not focusing on, oh, did I eat? Did I, you know, do the thing? Or you're thinking about straight thoughts, or thinking about, you know, what is that person wearing or doing? It's totally out of place. That breaks your immersion. For example, the Starbucks coffee cup in that scene, in the banquet scene, in Game of Thrones. A whole lot of people was all going, oh my god, this broke my immersion in short. So just lousy slip up of that can make a considerable difference. Like having a helicopter interrupt your video to break your immersion. All you could have known, I could have been whisked away in a mystical realm where there's elves, dwarves, orcs, danger could be lurking behind every tree. And hearing a helicopter breaks it. So, other things can break it, is just all willy-nilly half-cocked language people are talking about the things of popular culture, you can probably color that language in a way that you are not breaking immersion. Like you are making a reference to Facebook, you could say Book of Faces. Anything in reference to media, you could be, you know, saying, oh, i seen a play of that, and, you know, other things. Video game could be, um, improv theater. Just use your imagination, and when someone speaks, when they break immersion, you could probably say, um, did you mean fill in the blank? If you have a better alternative of what language they used. So, people will probably catch on without breaking your own character. And also to keep immersion flowing. So, I'm going to show you a little example of a tire they can break immersion right here. One of the things you spot right away that is not very immersive is the camera angle. If you look really closely, that one of my boots have no cover on it or gaiter. Let me fix that. That's better. I also want to, you know, say, lot with you know, certain standards of like attire, prosthetics if you want to be an elf, halfling, dwarf, 
you know, face paint. It's all to build up the atmosphere, to help keep things more immersive. So, with the group that I'm known to be shown with and play a lot in of Kana, they are having strict standards of, you know, prosthetics or you do not go on the field. You know, covering up your ears or whatever. If you don't have it, you you do not play. That, that is strict, but it's to encourage immersion in your character, in the system we're going through. They get bonuses for going through the whole idea. And other LOPs have, you know, requirements for, you know, weapons, attire, to, you know, make sure everything is at a level of immersion. You don't want to be the sore thumb when you're out there, you know, doing the thing and you are very up to place, like a time traveler. So, coming up videos, I am going to show you how to increase your immersion with footwear without breaking your bank. And to doing so, is alter certain modern footwear and adding a few more things to make it more immersive. So, by that being said, if this video got 50 likes within two weeks of when I post this, I will shave my legs for the next video where I'm gonna make medieval boot covers or footwear covers. So, it's all said and done. Make sure you subscribe, ring the battle bell, and also check out Max Sterling's video of how he makes some boots a little more immersive. By the way, Max Sterling from Lop Mix in the description down below and music by the Minstrel Raven it's being played by him and in this video in every video I have been posting and more importantly of all, all that then immersion is to stay hydrated we don't want anybody to pass out you know